Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm be unboxing my favorite for the month of July. So I'm very excited. So let's go ahead and open it. I will say that I already seen everything that's inside the box. And Fairloot loves to repeat items. I've been subscribed for about two years now. And I feel like they just do a rotation of the same items every once in a while, like every few months. So like... If you're going to subscribe to them, just know that you're going to get a lot of repeat items. They don't really try to do anything different um, in their boxes. It's just a whole bunch of repeat items. Because I think everything in this box, for the most part, is items that we have received already. And it hasn't even been a year since we received those items. So, yeah. So, they love to repeat items, which is fine, I guess. Um, but, like... At the same time, it's like you really don't need the same items so many times. But anyways, here is the theme card for this month. And our theme is Cruel Intentions. And this is just a spoiler card. So the first thing we have is socks. They love to do socks. I feel like we get a pair of socks every four months or so. And these are inspired by the Worker King socks. So, yeah. Um, so yeah, these are some nice pair of socks. I do like them. I like that they're black and white. Um, they're very, very nice. I like them. <laughs> There's not much I can say about socks. Um, I like fairly socks. They're pretty nice. Um, I love them. Um, and these are nice. So I'm happy with that. But again, we probably get socks like every few months. So yeah. The next thing we have is a pair of coasters set. And we received a pair of coaster sets from them a couple months ago, maybe. Um, but yeah, these are inspired by only a monster, um, which I'm excited. Um, I like coasters, though. I like getting coasters. But at the same time, I received so many coasters from all my subscription boxes and from Fairloot, of course. Um, but I do think it's been a year since we received the last ones. But yeah, these are very, very pretty. I like them a lot. So we have that one, and then we have this one right here, which is some wolves, two-headed wolves. We have a fox, and we have like a type of bird right there. So yeah, those are four coasters. I like the design of them. They're very, very pretty, so I'm happy with these. But again, I already have so many coasters, um, especially from Fairlies as well. But they are nice, so I do like them. Um, the next thing we have is an enamel pen again um we got 10 pens from fairloot a lot of times and this is just the nightmare pen designed by no one design right there it's very pretty i like it it's like a like a tarot card kind of um so this is inspired from one dark window so yeah it's nice i like it um yeah, anyways. Then we have Cruel Tetris Magnetic Bookmarks. Now, I think this is something that I probably have. I feel like they've done before, but I don't think they do many of these. But this is very, very pretty. Look how cute these are. They're so cute, and I love them. I love bookmarks. Um, so, I probably give us a lot of bookmarks, but I'm glad this time is a little bit different. They're magnetic bookmarks. And these are so, so, so cute. I'm very excited to use these. They're pink, they're beautiful, and I love them. So I'm really happy with this, and I wouldn't mind if I really do more magnetic bookmarks like this. Um, these are very, very pretty. So I'm happy with that. And I think those are just, like, not inspired by anything. Yeah, they're not. So, yeah, that's really cool. And then we have our... Volume 2 of the collection of Mortal Magical Tomes. This is part of a collectible they're doing this year, I'm pretty sure. Um, this is the second one we received. The first one a couple months ago. Um, so I'm excited to get this. I like these. These are just um, hollow books. Um, and I love them. Just because I store a lot of stuff in here. So I don't mind getting a few of these. Um, because I just store a lot of shit in it. But... This one is purple, which is so pretty. Look how gorgeous that is. Um, this is the Book of Fate. Very, very pretty. The spine and then the back. Very pretty. The pages. 
and then I opened up, we get the design here. So here it is. I like it. I like receiving these, like I said. Um, I like the details of this because I like to put stuff in here. So I'm very happy with this. Um, but yeah, and I think that's the last item. And then we have the actual book now. All right, so before we actually get to the book, we have our tarot cards, which I like receiving. They don't really have a purpose besides being actual tarot cards, but um, you gotta wait to get the full, the, the full deck. But we have Pace of Stars here, and we have Knight of Stars. Very, very pretty. I love these. Um, I like receiving these. I like the art style of these. They're very pretty, and these are inspired by the Sorcery of Thorns. Um, so yeah, I'm happy with these. They are very, very pretty. Okay, now we have the buck now. So let's go ahead and open it. And this is a book that our crate has done, I think last month, which I was not a fan of the our crate edition. I think our crate was really ugly, in my opinion. I know people liked it, but I was not one of those people. Um, we have the fairy scoop that I always come in the box. We have the bookmark that matches the theme, which I like receiving them. They're very pretty and nice. And then we have an art print here. And then behind the art print is a author's letter to the readers and that's very nice. I love this art print. This art print is so pretty. I like this. It's one of my favorites that I've seen. But yeah, this is gorgeous. And then we have the actual book here. And I like this more than the Owl Crate one because they do keep the original cover here. I like the original cover. It's just a little different, especially with the folding on the cover there. Very, very pretty. We have the spine and then the back here. Very, very pretty in my opinion. Uh, I will say the dust jacket it's very very thin it feels like paper like regular paper not even like thick paper so that's a little disappointing because it, it feels very cheap i'm scared that i'm gonna rip it very easily so that's a little nerve-wracking but very very pretty so let's go ahead oh, i'm gonna show you guys the spread edges the spread edges are pretty on the top and bottom so it's like a galaxy kind of with stars and then we have the centered um, edges there, and I love these. These edges are very pretty. They have some symbols, and I'm glad mine is actually pretty centered for the most part. It looks pretty centered, I think. I love them. They look really nice. Um, so let's go ahead and take off the dust jacket. Uh, we actually have a restful dust jacket artwork, which I like. Um, this one's more on the simpler side, and I feel like some people who don't like character artwork will prefer this side. Um, it is nice, but I do prefer um, the original cover there because the character artwork. Um, so that's really nice. I really hope they like keep giving us like the option of choosing, like giving a reversal of the jacket art like this. Um, I think that would be pretty cool. So I do like that. And we have this naked heart back with some folding on it. Very, very nice. Uh, very simple, but very pretty. And they had the spine there. Then we have some artwork on the end pages, which are very pretty, very simple, but very, very pretty. And then we have different end work um, end pages there. I like them, they're very nice. So I'm very happy with that. And then, let me see if it's signed or not. Okay, so there's a signature. I can't, I think, if actually signed and not digital, but I can't tell to be honest so it's sign of some sort i think it is sign actually so yeah that is the book for this month um i'm pretty happy with this box honestly i like all the items there isn't an item that i hate but like i said um these are a lot of the items that we received before in a fairly box before um but i love the book the book is uh, very, very pretty in my opinion. I love it and it's much better than the our crate edition So overall, I'm pretty happy with this box even though like I said a lot of the same as we see before but that's fine um, but Yeah, make sure to like comment below. Let me know your thoughts of the book and on the item um, Hit subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys